Well, hello there, everybody. This is Anger Warrior here. Very bad news today. I'm holding up my Nintendo hat heels for this one. Reggie, Faison May, the CEO and president of the Nintendo of America. Uh, I just heard he was retired now. It's to spend more time with his family and stuff. So when I first heard this news, because my big brother broke it to me, I was I, just, I watched the message and to be fair, I was kind of heartbroken because I grew up with Nintendo myself. I know I may be a small YouTuber, my message may not go out to everybody, but I grew up with Nintendo as well, as well as I grew up with PlayStation. Actually, I think I had the Game Boy before I had the PlayStation, or I had the PlayStation first, and then I got a Game Boy afterwards, so Game Boy got me into Nintendo, and I played a lot of games of Nintendo ever since. I know it was a phase in my life where I kind of grew out of playing Nintendo stuff because I, I don't know, I was kind of ignorant. I think it was still for kids at the time. But as I got older, I was introduced to it back to Nintendo even more. And I started watching E3 a bit more. I saw uh, legends like Satoru Iwata. I saw Reggie Fisume, Shigeru Miyamoto. I didn't even know who they were at the time. But the more I got used to them, it just felt like I was a part of a big, giant family, I feel. I feel Reggie Fisume is more wholesome. And I felt like he speaks as part of Nintendo than anybody, I feel. Because we all made memes about him. We all made jokes about him. Nintendo may have his ups and downs. The Wii U days were a bit disastrous in and of itself. But they took risks. And that's why this baby was still popular to this day. Even I bought one myself, despite its um, limitations at launch. But we're still stuck by it. We're still stuck by it. So, yeah, it all. But I, I, I wish I don't want to like hold off of this message saying because I did it for Satoru Watson. I mean, his passing is very, very tragic and all. It even broke me still to this day. And I just look back at E3 2015 because that was the first, that was one of the first times I saw Nintendo, and E3 2013 as well. And I see Satoru Watson, Reggie Fisume, and Shigeru Miyamoto as puppets, and it's just, it just really brings a smile to my face. It really does because. Even though the Direct itself was a bit of a disappointment to, to fans, you know, they had fun with it. The people on the Direct really had fun with it. They shared their life experiences and their stories behind the games they made. And they had really good intentions of making games that they want to make. So hearing about Reggie Feast May retiring after participating like so much with YouTubers, influencers, and other people alike in the Nintendo community, so. Yeah, it really hit home for me. So, again, I may be a very small YouTuber, but I want to I want to say, Reggie, thank you very much. You bring me a lot of memories about you, and I still look at the memes from you, you know, because you touched us in a lot of ways, and I still kind of joke about you sometimes. I joke about Pete Hines sometimes, but you know, we all joke about each other sometimes. That's just the way life is, right? I still play your games. I have all. I have most of your Nintendo handhelds. I have a 3DS with me right now. It's actually a new 3DS XL. I have a Switch. I had a DSi. I pretty much ha still have a Game Boy Advance and the Game Boy. I still have a Game Boy, so I still keep that with me because I treasure it that much um, as part of my childhood. So I did not want to lose that. If I lose the Game Boy, then it's like no way. So thank you very much, Reggie, and I do hope. I I, I wish you well. Everyone has wished you well, you have good wishes, and I just hope Doug Bowser can help stimulate the success of Nintendo and keep the, and to hope pass the torch from you one day. Let's see what he comes up with, I feel. So, yeah, enjoy your life, Reggie. Keep being ready. Your body is always ready. Just go to the gym more. And spend time with your son, spend time with your family. That's what Jack Back's been doing. He's spending some more time with his sons doing his YouTube stuff, I suppose. So, thank you, Reggie. Stay cool.